in the beginning. We would treat a horse and that horse would feel better immediately. And so the question becomes, how does that happen? How does it do that? People would ask me all the time, okay, what is this thing doing? Well, you as a doctor could certainly go into a much more detailed explanation as to what it does on the mitochondrial level or at the molecular level. But when I talk to people, I have a very, I try to make a, an explanation that they grasp and they can understand. And basically what we've got is a block wave that penetrates into the body and penetrates the blood cell and does something very basic. It makes the cell wall more permeable. And when it does that, it allows oxygen in and toxins out. It also allows proteins and other things that are that we're giving the body better to be better absorbed. But basically, oxygen in the cell produces a healthy cell or a cell that can better live its life and do its job. And, and that is so basic and when, when you explain it that way and say, so okay, so you take and you improve the oxygen in your shoulder right now, what's going to happen to your shoulder? It's going to feel better. Or you improve that oxygenation in the whole body, whether it's your whole torso or a whole horse or a whole dog or the joint, whatever it may be, that increased oxygenation will work for hours because it stays in the blood and it's it's just so cool and how that works and that's why it's quick. It's very quick uh, and in fact what the the talk that I've had because um, <laughs> my wife's bedtime story is me telling her my day at work using all of the the large language that we use as doctors and so that's kind of kind of her lullaby and so um, to break it down into layman's terms when I'm working with patients I tell them I said this is going to refresh your muscle it's going to eliminate the inflammation and it's going to recharge things so that when we're done it's you're going to actually still feel some of the pulsating going on and uh, it's going to make a huge difference. And, and one of the one of the great things that happened a couple of weeks ago, I was at a powerlifting competition as the team doc, and I brought the MagnaWave with me. And there was uh, one of the there was one of the gentlemen that came in, and, and he came in off the street in a business suit, and he was a powerlifter, uh, but now he's working in competition on uh, ice skating for the Olympics. And the instructor. Uh, one of the guy that was running the show, Kevin, he told me, he says, I want you to suit up and, and do this uh, powerlifting competition. Uh, and they were having a contest to see who could do the most um, uh, uh, squats of, uh, it's about 250 pounds. And so he was, do, he just put on an outfit, went out there and started lifting. So right off the street, went in and he did about 25 lifts and then, uh, uh, beat the or actually tied the competition is whoever could do the most would win and the other guy did 25 as well but he came over to where I was and I said you're the exact person that I want to try this out on and so I, I turned on the magnet wave and uh, I treated two minutes on his quads on his low back on his shoulders and what's interesting is when you go on the back over here and you're treating the um, upper back and torso that the pec muscles will start to flex as well because it just you can see it's penetrating going all the way through and after we were done I asked him how he felt he goes this is really weird he says I feel just like I did as I walked in through the door he says usually wow. I'm all puffed up and I'm just you know super tight and stuff and he was like super relaxed and he says you know and his legs are huge I mean his, he's got these huge quads on him and he said, there's this one spot, he said, I've, I've burned out five massage therapists trying to get this one spot in my legs uh, that just will not release. And I said, well, let's try this out. And so we did a really super focused beam right on his quads, right in the area. And I treated it both sides. And again, it was like for two minutes. Um, but after we were done, he says, that's the first time that that's ever been released. He said, this is, this is really amazing. And I'm Pat Ziemer. Because you're interested in learning more about MagnaWave, click this link below and I'll give you instant access to our video series. Thanks for watching.